subscribe to our channel click on bell icon you never miss any update hi guys i welcome you to the very first class on selenium automation before talking about selenium let's talk about a concept called automation testing first of all what is automation testing then we can discuss selenium or qtp or any other things but the primary question is what exactly the automation testing is so you people say that if i ask you a question like what is an automation testing definitely you will answer saying that automating testing activities using tool yes that's true i'm not saying that that's wrong that's perfectly correct but here the thing comes let us start from the very scratch actually what is an automation labor but testing in general scenario what is an automation automating human activities by some external force is called automation in whatever the field it may be same like that whenever the human activities or whenever the manual testing activities are automated by some external force like automation testing tool then we call that process as a automation testing means in the automation testing human activities are automated manual human activities are automated here comes the story what human activities are automated three human activities are generally automated one performing the user operation watching the actual behavior of a application providing the status these are the three things actually what will be automated now let's discuss about this let's see what happens in manual testing actually assume that here you people have uh, idea on manual testing if you if you don't have any prior manual testing knowledge need not to worry you will understand the concepts as we go into the subject okay now what happens in manual testing actually as a qa tester i'm talking about execution part i'm not taking about writing the test cases in manual testing i'm trying to talk about how the execution happens so now in manual testing as a manual tester you are going to directly interact with the application assume it take an example of a gmail login so as a manual tester you are going to write the username you are going to write the password you are going to click on sign in means you are going to perform all the user operations on the application that is point 1 point 2 because you have performed the user operations then obviously you will be watching the actual behavior of a application like whether it's moving on to the inbox or outbox what happened what is the behavior of a application after clicking on sign in then you'll record the actual result and you are going to compare it with the expected result and if both are identical you are going to provide the status for that event if it is identical it's passed if it is deviated it's failed means this three activities we'll do it whenever we perform manual testing now if it is an automation testing you need not to do these three activities anymore yes so just depending on your tool if it is qtp write the script in vb if it is selenium it understands multiple languages assume that we are writing in java means we are going to write a script which automates your tool depending on the tool you are going to write the code means we are going to give all the information to the tool means what is the username what is the password where should it click after clicking on what it should do what we are expecting now once we run it you need not to do anything tool will interact with the application it will write the username it will write the password it will click on sign in and it will check the actual behavior of a application it's going to compare with an expected result if both are identical it will say pass in the test result 
if it is not identical it will say fail in the test result so directly it will give you a test result so you need not to interact with the application anymore not only that you need not to watch the actual behavior you need not to provide the status everything tool will take care okay so this is what exactly the automation testing is whatever the tool it may be i am generalizing it clear now before going ahead let's discuss advantages of automation testing over manual